Hughes testifies regarding his $40 million plane contract before a Senate war investigating committee. Senator Ferguson questions the plane maker about a $200,000 loan allegedly requested by General Bennett Myers. Hughes, who previously testified he had been approached by Myers, supplies the details. Well, my God, he wanted, he wanted me or Hughes Tool Company to uh, <coughs> loan $200,000 toward the purchase of some Liberty Bonds, which were going to be purchased on margin. Now, he furthermore wanted me or Hughes Tool Company to guarantee that transaction against reduction in price of the bonds. In other words, if the bonds went down, he wanted me or Hughes Tool Company to agree to put up uh, further additional money to hold them. Now, the, the deal would have necessarily uh, been made through a broker, and it would have to be down in black and white. There's no way you could cover up a deal like that. Having denied indignantly that he asked Hughes for the money, General Myers, formerly Deputy Chief of Air Force Procurement, runs into heavy going. Clashing with Senator Ferguson, the general, who was directly concerned with the purchase of planes during the war, takes a firm attitude in reply to the senator's probing. Now, what do you say about that testimony where Hughes said you tried to get the money from him? Well, I said that's just a, just a terrific, careless use of the truth that it's ridiculous. I said that yesterday. Well, I say it again. Is, what does it amount to under oath, in your opinion? Well, I don't know what a, a lawyer or judge would call it. Well, you know what false swearing is, don't you? But, uh, sure, it's, it's perjury. Yes. Well, you, you are of the opinion, then, <laughs> that somebody's wrong here. That I they... certainly am. Very definitely so.